Hey Urvashi, what's going on? Hey Dad, I'm trying to figure out how many toy cars I have. If I put them in groups? Sure Urvashi, let's turn this into a fun game. How many groups do you want to make? I want to make three groups and I have two cars in each group. Hmm, so if you have three groups and two cars in each group, this sounds like multiplication. Multiplication? What's that? I haven't heard about it. Don't worry Urvashi, I'm going to help you. I will show you something cool about multiplication. Okay Dad, let's start. Well Urvashi, multiplication is a way of quickly adding numbers together. Let me show you. Look at these pictures of groups of the same items. Dad, it is not clear to me. No problem Urvashi. See here, we have four groups of three flowers. This means we have three flowers in each group and we have four groups in total. How many flowers do we have? Hmm, three plus, three plus, three plus three. That's twelve flowers. Right there? Exactly. Instead of saying three plus three plus three plus three, we can say 4 times 3 equals 12. We write it like this. 4 into 3 equal to 12. Oh, I get it now. We are adding 3 to 4 times. That's right Urvashi. We call this repeated addition. Now let's try some more examples. Look here Urvashi, we have two groups of three balloons. That's two into three, which equals six balloons. Can you fill in the rest of the multiplication facts? Yes sir. Great job Urvashi, you're getting the hang of it. Now let's look at the multiplication tables for numbers 2 to 5. Now do you know about tables? No dad, I don't know about tables. Ok, don't worry, I'm here to help. Let's start with the multiplication table of 2. Look Urvashi, here's the multiplication table of 2. It shows us what happens when we multiply 2 by different numbers. Ok Dad. When we multiply 2 by 1, we get 2. It's like saying 1 times 2 equals 2. I understood. 2 by 2, we get 4. It's like saying 2 times 2 equals 4. 2 by 3, we get 6. It's like saying 3 times 2 equals 6. 2 by 4 we get 8. It's like saying 4 times 2 equals 8. 2 by 5 we get 10. It's like saying 5 times 2 equals 10. 2 by 6 we get 12. It's like saying 6 times 2 equals 12. 2 by 7, we get 14. It's like saying 7 times 2 equals 14. 2 by 8, we get 16. It's like saying 8 times 2 equals 16. 2 by 9, we get 18. It's like saying 9 times 2 equals 18. 2 by 10, we get 20. It's like saying 10 times 2 equals 20. Yes, Dad, I got it. In the same way, we will learn table of 3. So, 1 times 3 is 3. 2 times 3 is 6. 3 times 3 is 9. 4 times 3 is 12. 5 times 3 is 15. 
6 times 3 is 18. 7 times 3 is 21. 8 times 3 is 24. 9 times 3 is 27. 10 times 3 is 30. Oh, this is amazing, Dad. I could learn in this way very easily. Now let's start with 4. Sure, Urvashi. 1 times 4 is 4. 2 times 4 is 8. 3 times 4 is 12. 4 times 4 is 16. 5 times 4 is 20. 6 times 4 is 24. 7 times 4 is 28. 8 times 4 is 32. 9 times 4 is 36. 10 times 4 is 40. What next, Dad? Now let's start with 5. 1 times 5 is 5. 2 times 5 is 10. 3 times 5 is 15. 4 times 5 is 20. 5 times 5 is 25. 6 times 5 is 30. 7 times 5 is 35. 8 times 5 is 40. 9 times 5 is 45. 10 times 5 is 50. This helped me a lot in learning tables. See Urvashi, with multiplication, we can quickly find the total number of items in a group without counting each one individually. Wow Dad, multiplication is cool. I'm glad you think so Urvashi. Now you can group your toys easily, right? Yes, Dad. I can make groups of toys much faster now. Multiplication makes it so easy.